Hey guys, it's Osiris VI here. I'm just doing a quick video on how you apply for Nuts for PC. First thing you need to do is you need to go online to any search engine. Um, Google works fine for me. I find I get the result, the first pick. What you want to do is you want to look up Nuts for PC. An, al an alternative to this is you can actually go up to the URL bar at the top of your browser and where it says google.com or wherever whatever site you're on you can actually type in nutsforpc.com no spaces and it's nuts with a Z and that'll also take you to the direct link if you do it through the Google method it's the first link uh, right here nuts PC rising from the flames comes eternal greatness you click on that and this is our clan website our clan home site what you want to do once you're here is you want to go to nuts pc team rules this is the first thing you've got to do uh, we want you to read our rules and it's right here on the sticky topic nuts rules so you just want you to take a quick look through here and it will tell you the basic rules of the clan what we what we expect of our members and of our staff uh, we want you to go through there, take a quick look. Um, after you've done that, you want to go back to the home page. And right here where it says application, please post your details before you register. We want you to click on that before you do anything else on the site after you've read the rules. Do not register a form account or it won't let you post properly. So you want to click on that and then you want to click on post application here. You want to scroll down some right down here to where it says application you want to copy this after you have it copied you want to go up here right where it says reply and you want to click on reply where it asks for your name you want to put your runescape name for me it would be Osiris VI and you want to put your email address and this needs to be a valid email address if you don't put a valid email address then um, any changes regarding this won't they won't be sent to you um, also when you do eventually register your account which is the next step after posting the application if you don't have a valid email address there um, then if you ever forget your site password then we can't send you a reset for that password your email that you use does not have to be your main email you just have to have access to it. You can make a fake email and use that as long as you have access to that email um, so that we can send you a reset for your password and stuff like that if you need it. Now, r first thing you're gonna do after you're here is post, not post, but paste what you put. You can either do control uh, V or you can do right click paste. And then you wanna fill the information in this application. So the first question is, have I, have I, I have read, understood, and will comply with Nuts rules? That is a yes. If you do not comply with the Nuts rules, then put no, but you most likely won't be accepted into Nuts PC. So we expect all members and staff to follow the rules. Your RS name is going to be your RuneScape name. For me, that's Osiris VI. You want your combat level. You don't have to put your pay to play combat level. You can put your free to play. And for me, it's 123 free to play combat. If you want to put your pay to play, you can put your pay to play combat. And then you put who you're invited by. Um, if you had a friend or a staff member refer you, then where it says invited by, put their name. Um, if you just happen to find this on the web uh, by yourself, you can put my name, you can put Osiris VI, or you can put nuts. Christopher and the next question is I agree to agree to PC chat off or set to friends so when you're pest controlling with us in our pest control world you always have to have your friends list on either friends only or off if we find a member or, or staff member in the PC world with their private set to on, um, we will ask them to turn it off. If we find it's 
a continual case where this happens a lot, then we could take action. That is up to the leaders, of course, what action they take. But it is a, it's one of our top rules in Nuts is to keep your private chat set to friends or off. And if you've had a previous pest control clan, please put their name. If you haven't been in a pest control clan, just put none. If you were in one though, we need you to post either a link to your reg resignation from that clan or a picture showing that you are in the process of resigning from that clan. Either or will work. If you're not on their list anymore at all on Runehead, then it should be fine as well. Um, if you have any problems, definitely just ask the staff and we'll help you along through that part. Um, after you've filled in that information like I have, you then click post. Oh, you're typing a new reply has been posted. One second. Oh. I think that's because of, oh that's because of my name. Sorry about that. It's because I've already used that name on the website, so this is this is basically what would happen if um, you registered an account first. It wouldn't let you post again. Pretty much, it might be a little bit different than this. Actually, actually, this is exactly what it would do. So if you registered first, just put your RuneScape name and then add a one or something to the end of it, and it should let you post fine, like so. Now, if you want to look at your post after you put it on, you can click on the last page. For me, it's number three right now. And this will take you to the last page in the applications, and you can scroll down. Yours should be the last post right here. Now, after you've done that, you go back up to the top, and you can either click register here or right over here. And what you're going to do here is you're going to register a site account. For me, it would be Osiris VI because you have to use your RuneScape name so that we can tell who's who. If you register your account under a different name other than your RuneScape name, um, we will change it to your RuneScape name so we know who is who. You want to put a valid email address in here. This is, like I mentioned, in case you forget your password. If you don't want others to see it, you can click hide email address from public. And then you're also going to enter a password. Now this password is going to be different from your RuneScape password. Do not use your RuneScape password. We do not suggest using it. Not saying that we're going to hack your account, but on any website other than RuneScape or FunOrb, do not use your RuneScape password. After you've filled in that information, then fill in the uh, information from the box just above here. This is a verification code. If you don't put that in, then it won't let you register a site account. And after you've done that, you want to scroll down, read the terms and agreements, click I agree, and register. I'm not actually going to do that because I actually have an account already registered. But after you've registered an account and it has been processed by a site admin and clan leader, it will then be approved and you can log in to the website using the area up here to the top right. You will get an email from Nuts for PC uh, stating that your account has been activated. After it's been activated, down below the the uh, topics here are going to change slightly. I'm not actually going to log in an account, um, but it will change slightly. You'll have more topics now that you can pick from, and about halfway through the page, you'll actually have the topic that posts the pest control world. Now, if at any time you want to get a hold of a staff member because you're having a problem, you can simply click on chat here. This will take you to a chat system built right into the website. It's hooked up to Swift IRC, and you can actually talk to staff members on here. If you have SwiftKit or MIRC, you can simply join the channel Nuts Lobby. Um, I'll actually post exactly what it looks like on the video. But if you have any other questions, leave a reply to this video. Um, you can add me in game, or you can use one of the three mentioned uh, three methods I mentioned before about contacting staff. And there's Mystery there, one of our leaders. So any questions, just leave a reply and I'll get right back to you.